Welcome to the Running Network Show. Join us each time as we explore the people, the places, and the events that shape our great sport. Hi, we're here with Ryan Shea. Ryan is actually here watching his little brother, Stefan, win the 3200 meter race today. And uh, it was kind of fun to see you with your, with your brother. Ryan, uh, tell us about uh, what's been happening to you the last couple of weeks. Well, um, I've just been trying to recover from uh, the marathon trials. And uh, I've, been, I've been spending some time back at the University of Notre Dame and um, came up here to watch uh, Stefan run. He did a great job and it was fun. I, I don't get many opportunities to watch him run, so I took advantage of it. And he's come and watched me run so many races, so it's just good to come, you know, return the favor. Well, it's, it's, it's interesting to see two strong competitors in the same family. Uh, several of us were watching you in the trials and really thought you had a good shot at it, but your injury kind of got in the way. Um, meanwhile, you managed to finish that marathon, even though you were injured with a pretty good time. Uh, tell us about that race. Um, well, I knew going into it, I was uh, a little skeptical about um, my health and, and uh being 100% with my uh, hamstring injury a, a week before the marathon, but uh, the first uh, the first 16 miles I felt fine, but then uh, just from somewhere between mile 16 and 17, I started to lose strength in the hamstring and overcompensation, and slowly my my body just started to shut down. That and uh, going into uh, the last loop, I was really considering um, dropping out of the marathon, but um, I heard someone say that I. Um, could still go under 220, so I'm like, okay, I'll, I'll switch my goals here a little bit, and you know, I don't want to get into a habit of drop, dropping out of, of a, out of marathon, so um, I toughed through it. Well, I know you uh, you, you dropped out um, earlier in the in, in Paris, but that made sense because you still had this one ahead of you. Um, tell us what what's on on your agenda now that the um, 10,000 meter trials are coming up in uh, July. Well, I want to. I really want to get back on the track. I haven't been on the track in the, in a while, um, but I want to make sure I'm 100% healthy before I um, push the issue with the track. What's your favorite event? Oh, uh, um, I'll, the marathon's definitely my favorite event. Okay, that's fair. The longer, the better. Well, you're pretty young for a marathon runner, so looks to me like you had pretty more, several more chances to be an Olympian at the uh, marathon distance, so uh, hang in there. Uh, I will, and I'm looking forward to uh, uh, 2008 in the, in the marathon trials there. Hopefully uh, I can redeem myself a little bit. I don't think you have to redeem yourself at all. You've had a pretty, great, pretty good professional career so far. Thank you so much for talking to us today. Thank you.